How to make a paracrut bracelet, the noble heart. Hello everyone, welcome back to the Alpha 1982 your YouTube paracrut community. I hope that you're all well safe and sound and that you're ready for today's beautiful paracrut project. Enjoy! Before we start, the credit for today's project goes to JD Lenson from Title Together, so make sure you check JD's channel as well. And if you want to learn how to make this awesome paracord bracelet I'm wearing today, the full tutorial you have in the top right corner of this video in the information cards, also down below in the description box. Today we're gonna use this red paracord 550 around 4.2 feet or 1.4 meters, and this dark gray around 6 feet or 1.7 meters in the metric measurements so we're gonna start by taking the ends of a red paracord and we're gonna pull it together so we'll find the center of a paracord and I'm gonna zoom a bit so you can clearly see so we're gonna start with the snake knot so we're gonna secure our loop or our eye of a bracelet take the left strand make it across on the right one to the back creating a loop and we're back now with this end or this strand sorry we're gonna make it to the back and from the back insert it into the loop here on the right side and we are finished our snake knot now we're gonna just rearrange a bit and we're gonna singe it and from here we're gonna take the dark gray, again take the ends, find the center. Now when we have the center, pull the red cords on top of the gray one and we're gonna start making the cobra knot or Solomon weave as you wish. So rest strand of the dark gray on top of those two red cords, the left one on top of this right strand cord and from the back side through the loop here from the back and through tight it and proceed and as you can see we're gonna continue with the cobra knot or salomon weave all the way until we reach the around half of a bracelet now as you can see this snake knot prevents our Solomon weaves or cobra knots to slip through or slip away from the bracelet. So here we almost reached the half of our bracelet. We're gonna pull this end aside and we're gonna, con we're gonna continue with our cobra weaves. Around three weaves or four will be enough I think. Thank you. 
And now we're gonna create the shape of a heart. So we're gonna take this end and we're gonna twist it like so. And one more. Now we're gonna take this loop here and we're gonna make it from the back through this first loop like so. And now from here we're gonna take the end of a red paracord, we're gonna pass it from the back through the first loop then here. And once more from the back through here. So as you can see we already have a shape of a heart, now we need to size it a bit smaller. I think this will be enough for my bracelet. So now from here we're gonna proceed with our Cobra Weave. So as you can see the right strand came from the back to the top and this left one from the top to the back so we're gonna make the left one again on top of the red cords or inner cords as you wish and on top and proceed. So from here we're gonna finish it with the snake knot. We're gonna use the snake knot for the stop knot. And we're gonna make two snake knots. One here on the end of a bracelet and we're gonna leave some space and we're gonna make the second one So our today's project is finished, I hope that you like it, if you do don't forget to leave a like, share this video with your friends and the family and if you're not subscribed consider subscribing and hit the bell button so you'll be notified whenever we post a new video. So that being said, until the next time, stay safe, be well, wishing you just best and see you soon, bye!